You probably have heard that black holes form in the aftermath of a supernova, but I bet you didn't know that they can cause supernovas to occur as well. Astronomers have been able to detect an event involving a black hole as it feasted upon a star from the inside and causing it to explode in a brilliant supernova. It seems that every time astronomers look deeper into the cosmos, they discover something new that has yet to be understood. Is there a space discovery that had you speechless and racking your brain for an answer? This is matter. And here are the five most mysterious space discoveries that are hard to explain. But we'll try. Number five a star and a black hole meet in unlikely circumstances. Over the last few decades, science has made major advances in space, but some of the biggest mysteries in the universe are still yet to be solved. In this rare event, a super dense object like a black hole or neutron star falls in and gets consumed by a star. This then leads to the core of the star being consumed by the black hole, causing the rest of the stellar body to explode in a massive supernova. In 2014, a team of astronomers were able to detect an enormous source of X-ray radiation, and upon closer inspection, discovered what had happened. They believe they found what was once a binary star system where two stars orbit each other. When one of the stars died in a supernova, it left behind a black hole that eventually was pulled into the remaining star. After the second star goes into the supernova, only a black hole is left where the core used to be at the center of the star. Number four, a strange force called dark energy is driving the expansion of our universe. Everyone has heard that the universe is expanding, but did you know that the universe is actually increasing the rate at which it expands? Behind this expansion is dark energy, which is a mysterious force that makes up 68% of the entire universe. Scientists are not entirely sure what dark energy is or how it accelerates that expansion of the universe, but there is no denying what we can see happening. It acts somewhat contrary to gravity driving objects in the universe away from each other at an ever-increasing speed. But it wasn't always like this. In the first few billion years after the Big Bang, the universe was expanding, but the expansion was slowing down. Some scientists attribute this slowing to gravity. But around five billion years ago, the tides shifted and dark energy took over control of the universe and the accelerated expansion began. There are no signs that the expansion is going to slow down or stop at any time. If it doesn't slow, dark energy will not only cause galaxies to fly away from each other, it may eventually pull galaxies and planetary systems apart. And in the end, it could even drive apart the atoms and subatomic particles that make up our universe in an event dubbed the Big Rip. Don't worry too much. If this is going to happen, it won't be until billions of years into the future. Number three, strange cages of carbon floating through the cosmos helped answer a century old mystery. For nearly 100 years, astronomers kept seeing light from a specific region of the Milky Way behaving strangely, but had no idea what could have been causing it. It wasn't until the accidental discovery of a special molecule of carbon called the unique name of Buckyballs and its later detection in space that this mystery was finally laid to rest. Buckyballs are microscopic balls that are essentially cages made up of carbon atoms arranged to look very similar to a soccer ball. These molecules were accidentally discovered in 1985 while scientists were studying the aging of carbon-rich stars but they were not seen in space for another quarter of a century. In 2010, NASA's infrared telescope named Spitzer finally detected buckyballs inside the remnants of a star in the Milky Way. Once discovered, astronomers were able to measure the wavelengths of light that were being absorbed by them, confirming that they were indeed buckyballs. 
While scientists still aren't sure how buckyballs form, they do know some areas where they are formed, and they also know that buckyballs are far more abundant in the universe than previously believed. These tiny balls float in space and absorb specific wavelengths of light as it passes through them, leading to various features that we can see throughout the cosmos. Number two, special neutron stars exist that produce insane magnetic fields that span vast areas around them. When stars of a certain size reach the end of their life, they die in a fantastic supernova explosion that blasts out the outer layers of the stellar body while the center collapses to form a neutron star. Neutron stars are the densest objects that can be seen in the universe, and their immense gravitational forces create a star made entirely of neutrons. But something far stranger and much more dangerous than a neutron star is created under certain conditions. Called magnetars, these exotic neutron stars are characterized by their slower spins and powerful magnetic fields. These objects are incredibly dense. Just a tablespoon of their substance would weigh over 100 million tons. They also have an enormous supercharged magnetic field that extends far past its surface into the surrounding space. First discovered in 1979, only a handful of these superpowered magnetic stars have ever been found and we still don't know that much about them. Perhaps their signature magnetic fields are produced by their interior structure that formed amidst the violent environment of a supernova. Hopefully, scientists will be able to study these more in depth and find some answers. Number one, ultramassive black holes may exist with masses far exceeding what scientists thought was possible. Scientists have found a black hole that blows all others out of the water in terms of mass. First theorized by Einstein in his theory of general relativity, black holes are some of the most destructive objects that have been found in our universe. Super dense and extremely heavy. Black holes produce a massive amount of gravitational energy that some scientists believe punctures a hole in the very fabric of space-time. For a long time, astronomers believed that black holes could be big, but not that big. That is, until they discovered that supermassive black holes exist and sit at the center of many galaxies in the observable universe. After they found this, many thought that a theoretical limit on the size of black holes existed and that supermassive black holes reaching a billion times that mass of our sun was the max. But recently, new monsters have been found in galaxies nearly 3.5 billion light years away from Earth. Black holes that sit at the center of galaxies are thought to grow in tandem with their galaxies, but these ultramassive black holes are currently growing at a rate that exceeds the growth of their galaxies. Astronomers have estimated that they may be as large as 100 billion solar masses. What new discoveries have astronomers made that left them scratching their heads and searching for an answer? Thanks for watching. See you next time on Matter.